So this is busy downtown Tarshaven. This might be a mad move to make, to drive into the Friday evening traffic in the middle of the town. But here you go. <laughs> What's the prison? Because I had to go down there to fill in a farm about me, walk down. How many people are in there? Twelve. I think they're in for course and not referees. This is the centre of town. This is where it all happens, right? This is really you now where the hot spots of town are, you know? As you can see, it's very busy and kind of frantic. Brian is four months into his reign as Pharaoh manager. It's a chance to relaunch his international career, but the odds are stacked against him. I think there's an old Chinese phrase about not criticising the man unless you've walked in the shoes. Well, you know, I much prefer to walk in these shoes. Well my Achilles tendon has given me a very sore here, right, giving me chip. So I probably did a bit much this morning. I was, I was uh, up walking the hills this morning, you know. It's just a little bit sore. I'm surrounded by such a... There's such a fantastic medical team here that I won't have to go to Lourdes. I think, in general, I'm at a stage where I'm generally quite composed in games. For fuck's sake! You fucking brought them out of it! That's a terrible fucking... You saw it yourself! Fucking... You know, I'm back in this and uh, I have every ball of it. Never mind your team. I understand you, yeah? I've been with teams and had frustrations and ups and downs and saying been robbed by referees and the last man's decisions over the years. Respect, please. Okay? You respect me as a coach. You hear managers in the various leagues complain that the big teams always get the decisions, they get the penalties and the, the red cards given against the smaller teams and they don't get penalties. There's no yellow card, no? So I have to stand up for them because I think I can influence almost nearly every kick of the ball because I can help with the decision making. Of you will learn from today. Brian Kerr is now on a very different journey. This time it's about redemption, reviving his passion for the game and striving towards the moment it all proves worthwhile. After all, football is a results business. Unfortunately, I may be measured by the results of a team that it's almost impossible to, to win matches with. But I, I quite enjoy that challenge of doing something with somebody that most people would give us no chance with. I have, just hope that it all clicks one day, that we get that lucky day. And I'll give it my best here to come up with results that make the public here happy and the, the, the team happy and me happy and the association happy enough to maybe give me a, renew my contract when the time comes. <laughs> <laughs>